thank you everybody for tuning in oh, uh, to the weekly social. It's all things Katie, Fulcher, Richmond, Texas. Uh, we had a thousand plus views last week, so hooray. Um, and he caught us having a little fun behind the camera just now, I believe. So <laughs> we're running a little bit uh, behind schedule today. We've had a little bit of technical difficulties. We're oh. learning so much though. However, you're seeing a bunch of different stuff today. All thankful to John Oatmushi, as well as Jason. Uh, we have Taff on board today with us, and they brought a bunch of cool stuff that we're playing with, different cameras, microphones. We have Priscilla Poff with uh, Select Title. Hi, guys. Thank you for being here. I'm excited. Yeah. I'm excited to be here, and I love having a wireless setup because we can take it and move it and move around. And Joe is the man. Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. I am the man. Mm -hmm. um, he saved the, the microphones he really did. way over here. Mm -hmm. uh, and my camera is wonderfully frozen, but that's okay. You can hear my luscious voice. Yeah. <laughs> and Richard, I want to thank you for letting us be on your show. Really appreciate it. Oh, no. Uh, hey, thanks for coming right. out and, and uh, setting all this up today. Yeah. It's incredible. Um, you know, Taff, I met these guys at one of our networking events. Yeah. They have uh, the similar business mindset that I have uh, about giving to receive, and they do a lot for the local community. So we've connected, and uh, we're building our business relationship, and now yeah. we're doing this podcast together today. So, hooray. It's great. I mean, we're an IT consulting firm here in the Houston area, and we really want to serve the community. We met you at the Mixer, and it was an amazing Mixer. Oh, thank you. And, and to be really honest with you, when we, when we started talking, we thought, wouldn't it be great to take what you're doing with your community and really put it on steroids. And so that's why we wanted to come out and bring the cameras and see what we can do. That was exactly the conversation that we had over uh, coffee verbatim. That was the line that, that <laughs> right. Sean said. So wait a minute, are y'all thinking about these networking events and maybe doing some little podcasts yes. with the end? To go deeper, we actually went and make the mixers live. If that's something we can talk about later on. Oh, how cool I think that is that? Would be very cool. So imagine you missing the mixer, but being a part of the mixer from home or wherever you're at. And he's still being able to communicate. Perfect. Yeah. He's also discussed setting up a computer so when people ask questions or you can kind of communicate back and forth all at the same time right. live. Right. Which I believe we can do that today. Is that correct? Absolutely. So Absolutely. right now when they're asking comments or questions, uh, we can definitely communicate with them and, and go from there. But in the mixer, imagine having a screen where you can see the, the live conversations and we can talk directly to them. Wow. Yeah. A lot of great things we can do. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Wow. The power of the Internet. How do we learn about all these things that you can do? Because well, it's above and beyond what we think about. Well, you know, social media is constantly changing. You know, it's, an, it's an evolution. It's constantly changing. The technology that we're using, believe it or not, right now it's the state of the art. But in six months, it's not going to be. It's right. constantly changing. So for us, we're always doing professional development, just like your teams are in real right. estate. So we directly connect with that. So just staying up to date with it. Wow. So y'all are the guys to make that happen and teach us. We're and, here to serve y'all. And to keep that value. That's right. That's right. Wow. Absolutely. Yeah. And they both have very interesting backgrounds. Yes. Yes. So I worked for Houston Community College for about 13 years. I was in, in higher ed. I was a dean of IT and advanced manufacturing. and then after Dean that, of IT. Yeah. Dean. And yes. And then um, after that, I worked for IBM, X-Force Red, doing vulnerability management services enterprise. And then you know what? I really missed working with the community. And that's why I partnered with Joe and Jason to create TAF Solutions to really be the community technology partner for the Houston area. That is cool. And then we found y'all. Yes. And we're like, you guys are doing some amazing things. Okay, Jason, what about your background? <laughs> well, I've been in the uh, media production industry for over 20 years. I did a lot of work in various, various different places. And one of my favorite places, of course, and my, of course, my camera is still frozen. So we'll just get off that. <laughs> um, it's wireless. It's, it's, it's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. It's, um, it, you can kind of see me guys, but, mm -hmm. but, but you yeah. can't see me in motion, mm -hmm. but no, uh, what we've, what I've been doing for many clients, everything from video games, mm -hmm. all the way to healthcare, all the way, you know, advertising you said video games. Yeah. Yes. Wow. I worked for a video game company called TimeGate uh, studios. And Sugarland, they were there for many years till 2012. They unfortunately okay. closed up shop, but uh, I still work with in that industry. Still, uh, people call on me to do trailers and various other things like that every now and then. Okay, um, but oh, no, I, cool. I do a lot of business though with with oil and gas. Um, has been my bread butter up until uh, right until 2020, which I think okay. we all know what kind of happened there. Yes, sir. And then uh, <laughs> it's it's uh, unfortunately a lot of people left that industry, but. 
I still work with them and uh, we do great work together, but I also work with the community and, and I've always been a very, you know, I, I love my oil and gas friends. I love the big companies that I work with, but at the same time, I, uh, it's not the owners I'm talking to. It's not the people that I'm impacting the most when I create something for them. And that to me is far better than the dollar amount or the reach, you know, if I can get them to do something that really impacts what they're doing and, and make them expand, help them expand and be successful. Yeah. It's, it's emotional for me. It's very, very important. That's community involvement. Yes. I mean, if you look at the local swim teams, baseball teams and stuff, who are they sponsored by? They're not, it's not big corporate America. Yeah. Exactly. It's the local business owners. Guys. Richard like, Lunac, yeah. Red Line yes. right. Yeah. Yeah. If it wasn't for your mixers, we would have never met all the great people we met. So please come out to the mixers. Please do. Yes. Okay. It's, we host two of the largest mixers on the west side of Houston. We have one. It's the Richmond Fulcher one at the Brass Tap. Uh, that's the first Thursday of the month from 530 to 730. Uh, the third Thursday of the month, we're at Gaucho's, and that's from 530 to 730. We typically see anywhere on average from 60 to 80 people. Now, some are a little lighter, some are a little heavier. But for the most part, that's what we typically see. And it's just a great mix of people. They're all business owners, community leaders, professionals, and they're all there to do the same thing. Support our community and, and grow a business and commerce. Right, right. Met some wonderful people out there. Bring lots of business cards because you're yes. going to need them. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yes. It's a different vibe than most networking events. It yes. just is. It's uh, a non-networking event. Yeah, it's Always the anti-networking anti -networking networking event. Right. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. yes. So. That, I mean, truly is the largest one in Katie. Or two in Katie. Yeah. I would also say the quality of them are wonderful. We, we go to a, quite a few of them and they're paid as well. Yeah. These are free and it's quality events. You need really great people. Yes. 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 D decision makers. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I mean, mm -hmm. th that's the hard part is to meet the decision maker and marketing yourself to somebody that you can't market to. Right. I mean, so I, that's how you get in front of the market. You get to meet people like that there where if you go to their office, you're not going to get past the goalie typically. Right. You know, one thing that I noticed and from some of your emails yeah. are the strategic planning that you do with the marketing. I love what you're doing, oh, especially some of your events. Maybe we can talk about some of the new events that you got going on with the, the backpack drive. Right? Yes, we are doing a back to school backpack drive. Um, Priscilla's actually helping me with that. She's the drop off point at Select oh. Title and mm -hmm. Katie. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, if you go to our Facebook page, Red Lion Realty Group, uh, we have a uh, a couple posts there, and we've shared it out amongst groups. Uh, we, we've already gained a lot of traction. Right. You just click on the Amazon link, uh, and they got stuff as little as ten dollars. I want to say the average backpack with a handful of school supplies is sixteen dollars. So yeah, you can donate That's something awesome. for under twenty bucks. Uh, shipping's very minimal, so mm -hmm. it, actually it's free if you push it out a couple days. They don't charge anything at all. Right. Right. So if you would, and I please think the deadline that. is the 16th. August 16th is the deadline. Okay. And everything that's bought is going to be donated to KDISD Sundown Elementary. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. True. Love it. You're always doing those things for the community. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, yay. I'm a highly unpaid volunteer. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it always comes back to yes. it. Yes. It's passion. And I just found out about the Ballard House has another. Um, Aaron Ballard, who the Ballards, of course, are part of the Ballard House. Um, but um, she just shared with me that Fort Bend County buy, sell, and trade. All the donations, people are going and buying plants there, are going back to the Ballard House. So check that out on Facebook right. groups Which, for that support for the Ballard House. That gives free housing for people that come down here for medical treatments. That's a wonderful. lot of people are not familiar with the Ballard House. It, it's really a, a great thing in our local community. Anybody that's outside, you know, the area and needs a place to stay while they're coming in for treatment for medical, you know, cancer, limb, heart, oh, wow. whatever. For up to three months. Doesn't it's, it's matter your age. There are 42 rooms at the Ballard House. Wow. See, this is why you have to network with people. For you yes. to learn all these great things. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. I, I had no idea. Joe, did you know about this? No, no, I had no clue. I, I'm actually It's right there on fresh. Mason and... 
Between Fry and West Hammer Parkway. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll definitely share this with, with, with our Facebook group as well and be more than happy to promote this. This is wonderful. Awesome. It's really awesome. great. Awesome. Yes. Yeah. So it's Thank you. to do that. Oh, my pleasure. I mean, it's uh, anything we can do to help the community out is, you know, really just the goal. Because like you said, it comes back. It really does. It does. But you awesome. just know how many people you touch by oh. helping and that it just makes all the difference in the world mm -hmm. and their yes. lives. You can see it in your local community. A lot of that big national stuff, you donate, but that, that, all you did was donate. You never see any mm -hmm. of the results. Yeah, no. and it's going to the higher-ups and not taking care of the people that need it. Unfortunately, a lot of that big national stuff, 90% goes to income, 10% to the charity. That's the sad part where the stuff around here locally, it's just the opposite. Almost 100% goes to the charity and the all the rest house, is- I think we're at 98%. 98% goes to wow. charity. Wow, that's, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. really, it's that's huge. Yeah. Good to know that. It really yeah. Is. Yeah, really yeah. but that was structured that way. Mm -hmm. To make the sure. Get -go. Okay. Yes. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. But the Katie community, it's about Katie mm -hmm. and everybody giving back and helping and supporting and doing all those things. Absolutely. Yeah. That's what makes a difference. What are you guys participating in right now? So the Georgia? latest one right now is we work with a 501 c known as Family Promise, Clear Creek. We do a lot of donation yes. time over there. Family Promise, Family Clear, Promise Creek. Okay. Clear Creek. And so we're learning something too. Uh -huh. Absolutely. And so they, they support uh, displaced uh, children and, and families especially uh, wives that have been, you know, through domestic violence and so okay. forth. And they really are taking care of the local community in towards the Clear Creek area. And so we've been working with them. We help them with their website, with their phone systems, and really trying to support them and making sure their infrastructure is there so that they, they can continue supporting the community. With so their you're giving them resources oh, to be a resource cool to that? somebody that yep. needs a resource. Absolutely. So yes. you guys are doing it behind the scenes. That's awesome. Thank you very yes, much. Yes, absolutely. You. We're always here to support. We're always willing to volunteer and donate time. We do quite a bit of that ourselves. We'll, we'll take time out. We'll go out. We'll, we'll do free consultation. And then when we find out what their specific needs are, if it's in our wheelhouse, we'll take care of them. If not, we'll always find other people to help. Yep. So one way or the other, we got you. So we always yep. say we're your community technology partner, but we partner with other vendors in the same yep. area to help out. But that's what's cool. And that's, you know, that's when everything comes together. And it's like, okay, I may not can do it, but I do know who to tell you to talk to to get Absolutely. to it. Absolutely. Right. And that right. is huge. Well, it's like we were talking about password management today. You know, it's yeah. like, well, what do you Last do pass. if you have so many passwords? Last pass. You know, it's a yes. great product. You know, you have one master password and you're able to create complex passwords for everything. That was my problem I just had. I had to call somebody right, to have yeah. them tell me right, what right. my password was. <laughs> <Right. laughs> and that is a challenge that everybody has. And you know, every organization has a different complexity, you know, and you have to create a password. So using the password management utility is really going to be able to help you. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. good information. Yeah, yeah, and it makes it great because, you know, I don't have to remember all of my passwords. My wife doesn't have to remember all of her passwords, except for that one. But, you know, it's also security. It's a security thing, too. So yeah. instead of having to ask other folks or, you know, hey, what's that post-it note that's, you know. The notepad where you crossed right it out, corner. 90 yes. days expired. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. Right. Or as, yes. or as mm -hmm. my, my grandmother used to do, you know, she had a post-it note, like, right here at the computer. You know? <laughs> yeah. And it was all the passwords <laughs> right there. Oh, so oh I love that. So great. <laughs> well, I have a book, and it's a similar password with, like, 50 different variations of it. So I always start with my default one and oh. kind of move forward from there. And you just change the letter. You go from A to B yes. to C to D, <laughs> yeah. right? Or, yeah. or the here. Yeah, I'm very which sophisticated. Is, right. Which right. is right. not the safest way for us no. to do it. No. So, no. oh, There's a wow. lot of best practices. There are a lot of great things. And we're looking forward to working closely with you all and being able to educate your, your realtors and, and so forth. You know, I am so excited. We're excited, too. Yeah. Really are. And you guys are working on uh, track courses we are so our focus is really towards the technical side to support your realtors really bringing them some hands-on guides on being able to help them on digital marketing campaigns 360 tours best practices so even if you're not using tap solutions we're here to make sure that you understand what you're getting into it's kind of like having a good mechanic on your side yeah you take it to the other mechanic across the street mm -hmm. you check it out and you get a second pair of eyes to help yes. that's how we look at right. it right that's funny you say that because my mechanic this week told me, you know, I needed shocks on my Jeep. Yeah. And he said, you know, but for a hundred dollars more, we can put the lift kit, which includes the shocks, do all of that for a hundred dollars more. 
That's a no brainer. Yeah. All right. But that's right. It's having that second eye, you know, really mm -hmm. being able to help you out. It's kind of, we talked about, look, this whole video podcast system, you know, we can do it for you or we can tell you how to set it up and you can yeah. go to town. And then you can put it on how many platforms if you do ten. it that way? You can do up to 10 platforms at a time. Yep. Right. It's amazing yep. what you can do. All and once. they got some really cool stuff that we're playing with here. I don't know if you can show it to them in the cameras, but I sure can. Um, so what I've got set up right here, as you guys can see, hi. Hi. How's it going? Oh, oh. <laughs> Not you, frozen anymore. Yay. yay. <laughs> but... Well, wait, we've got our wonderful board right here, which is where everything is being piped into for the audio. And of course, from there, it's going right here into this computer, as you can see. And what's great is that I'm able to take all of this, plug it into one program, and it sends it out to the Facebook or anything else that we want. Now, there are other ways to do that. You can talk to us on how specifics, you know, like we can talk about specifically how it works whenever you guys give us a shout. But definitely... Um, the way things are going now, this is really the way. In fact, this is kind of the way that uh, uh, we video video is everything. Today. Yeah. It well, is. for the networking events, that's kind right, of what you right. would do, right? Well, absolutely. Well, and we would do a very similar at, uh, way of doing that, but it'd be a little more passive. If we we're doing like a, 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 we were talking about the mixer, uh, I think earlier off camera, mm -hmm. yeah. and um, that would be uh, like, oh, you can see who's there, what's happening around in that location, you know, like. It, we kind of like it's a preview, if you will. And, and if I may up. add, yeah. this is not proprietary equipment. It's not. This is open source. Yes. A yeah. lot of the technology, the hardware is not free. Software is free. We'll send you the links. So if anybody's yeah. interested in your community, especially those that are running nonprofit organizations, we're more than happy to help you set this up. Churches use this all yes. the time. You know, those that yes. are trying to get across whatever message they have. Oh, it's very okay. Helpful. So you're saying like they're Sunday mornings and stuff when they absolutely they so you're, you're, you're attending before people... you go attend. You're just right. doing it live. Right. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, that's so cool. if you want to dip your toe in the water, you can see yeah. it in the comfort of your own home and go. Right. Oh, you know what? That looks really cool. Right. I think I'll go check that right. out next week. Yeah, that's right. awesome. And one of the latest things I've been working, I know you probably can't do it on here right now, yes. but with the 360 cameras, we do a lot of digital assets where we can import into your tour. Mm -hmm. so you've probably seen realtors have tours for homes, right? right. Correct. So you, they do the tour inside the house. That we can do the outside now because we got a new technology called Matterport 3, and it doesn't impact with the sun because it's using a LiDAR technology instead of the traditional uh, infrared. Right. So they, so the sun would mess with, with the camera. Like you literally could not get a good picture of it. But with the new technology, you can. So now you get the backyard, you get the side of the house. It's all can be included in the tour. And on top of that, what's great about the, uh, get my camera so people see my beautiful face while I talk. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> but uh, what's great about it is, is that you can take, like he said, and put information in there that you want people to know. Like, for instance, let's say, and I'm sure you guys have seen it, you know, because you're in the industry, you, you've yeah. seen these wonderful, uh, uh, crazy things people put in their houses that are just so unique and you can put that in like a you know oh it's you can put it in the description but people may not really click on it right they don't, right. They don't, they don't right. see it until like you know maybe they see it in person they go oh that's what they meant yeah but with a virtual tour what's great is you can point that out using some of the technology out that people aren't really using right now <laughs> um you can actually point that out and actually talk about it in a video right there in the virtual tour or even on a website, you can tie a website to an icon that somebody can click on in the virtual tour, and it pops up a bunch of information. Let me paint you a picture. Let's say that you have a realtor that has a brand new house going on the market. Okay. 6,000 square foot house. Yep. A beautiful house. Great. Looks great from the outside. From the inside, it's really decked out, ready to go. And you want to sell it and you want to promote that. You create the 360 tour. But here's the thing. You walk in, and when they're looking at the virtual tour, starts playing a particular song. You walk into the formal dining room, it plays a different song. You go to the bedroom that's all Disney decked out for the girls, right? right. You play the Disney song, right? Yes. This can all be done inside the tour. The goal behind this is to help promote and get that experience out on what it would be like to be in the house. It warms the video is what yes. I'm hearing. Yes. Correct. 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 You're making it personable. It's not like, well, here's like the tour, the click, 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 click. Which is in. what most videos <laughs> right. are. Right, and that's really boring. Cool. <laughs> that's really boring. But look, if you that's really want to help people sell that, <laughs> that house, you know, it's about that experience, right? And sometimes you wow. can't either. Totally get it. But what if we can make the experience enhanced? So that's yes. the great work that we can do 
with that. And if you already have the camera, we can show you some great ideas and tips and tricks you can do to do that. Yeah. Yeah. So it's really about your industry and how you guys can promote the work that y'all are doing. Mm -hmm. Because how many people come in or don't come in and have bought houses sight unseen by just walking with people all over the world? Through. And let me tell you that uh, when I'm using uh, my iPhone, whether it's WhatsApp or whatever, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm doing a video tour walkthrough with them live, but it's not going to be of the same quality or anything mm -hmm. like with these gentlemen are discussing. Well, it's interesting you mentioned that. So we're using Matterport technology, which there is a free version for your realtors if they want to give it a try. It's Matterport. called Matterport.com. Yes. And what they can do is they can get the free version of it. They can put it on their actual telephone using either the iPhone or the Android. Okay. Correct. So here's the challenge. Let's say you take this. This is what? 400 square feet, 300 right. square feet. But let's just assume this is 300 square feet. You're going to have to do this with your phone all like this. And then it's going to have to stitch everything together. You have to manually do it. We have one camera. Yeah. That's about yay big. Okay. This isn't a tripod. We can do three scans in about 10 minutes. It stitches it all together in nice, high quality. That's the difference between doing it the old school way right. versus what we're talking about. Wow. The camera costs $6,000. Okay? Wow. So there's a difference. So when people say, right. well, I'm, I'm doing that all the time. I need that well you're absolutely right you can definitely do that but let's say that you have a twenty-eight thousand square foot facility you're doing commercial real estate that's where our, our property is located mm -hmm. we did the entire outside in two hours it takes about 24 hours for it to stitch and render it's all online you can put on google maps you're good to go take it one step further you need two-dimensional flooring maps it creates that for you you have you have problems later on where you have a disaster fire or water mm-hmm you can use that to be able to give it to insurance adjusters through the file format that it does. And that's there's a lot of really yeah. interesting aspect wow. of it. So there's yeah. a lot to so, it. Yeah. And it's, it's not a, just the video, so it's the dynamics of it. There you go. Everything else you matter for credit for. Correct. Yeah. And so, it yeah. ends on the actually like what's great about the right. cameras that we have is that it's such a high quality in terms of like you met it's like light R is basically just a bunch of lasers going out and finding how far away something is. Okay. It's all it is. And so it's like a little shotgun that's going and shooting out lasers. Yeah, that's all it's doing. But what's interesting about that is it creates what we call a point cloud. Now, just hold on a sec. It's, follow, it's, it's actually okay. pretty simple. simple do you think it is? And all you're doing is just basically saying, okay, I know that that's there. I know every little piece of this is there, right? And then it constructs the 3D like aspect. So it models model, are in 3D. Yes. Right there from that information. So just imagine you're a blind person, you're walking okay. around, you're going, okay, this is here, this is here. In your mind, you're creating the scene, right? Mm -hmm. It's that. That's it right there. And so what it does now is you can put whatever you want in that space. Say I want to put an additional 3D model, chairs, desks. I can dress the scene in the tour. And so it looks real. It looks real. Let's go one step further. Let's assume I'm going to get you out of the 3D model space and move it into more of a practical piece. So right. maybe you're a general contractor. Maybe you got a realtor who says, hey, look, this, this property needs a new outdoor kitchen. The, the owner is trying to sell it and they want to spend a little money on that. Mm -hmm. Well, no problem. You can have the general contractor go work with a CAD drawing, yeah. develop it. Joe can take it, scan it, and make it look like what it's supposed to look like and the customer can see it. A lot of great things you can do. I was just about to yeah. say, are y'all working with architects on this? We do. We work with architects, general contractors, whatever the yes. case is. I mean, our, our goal is is to really support whatever business you have because we're in IT. We, you need us in right. whatever, we, whatever whatever industry you're in. How cool know? is that, though? So, as a home, yeah. you know, I want to go buy a home. The architect puts it all together, and you're looking at this drawing, and you're like, okay, yeah, looks most people look good. at blueprints, and it's like trying to figure out Chinese arithmetic. Yeah. Right. It is. Right. Right. They, they, they yeah. can't. But right. you're taking Vision. it to the next we step. We work with structural engineers that are they're better PE certified, and yes. we help them with when they're doing their surveys, right. when they're looking at the structural integrity. Uh, the tools that we have really supports that. So it really depends on whatever the industry is. But and insurance companies with yeah. this program yeah. that you right. know. And like I said, this, these products are available for everybody to use. These are these are normal uh, products people can have. Yeah. Nothing's. Per from uh, for our side, we're just here to support the community. So mm -hmm. if you can give us a call. Any help we can go. give in, 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 in either the service itself or just even pointing them in the right direction. Because again, it's about serving them and helping them move their business along.
it, that's that's it's great. I actually absolutely adore the fact that we can do that. But on top of that, if 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 we're just here helping you figure it out, you know, and but don't have you don't have the time to do it yourself. That's where we can step into. Guys, y'all are amazing. Yeah, well, you know, absolutely amazing. You know, we're talking Thank about you. social media and the cadence. And I yeah. think one of the most important things is just, you know, keeping that cadence and keeping keeping it going. So if you're out there consistent, being disciplined. I use the, the trash man. Now. I use the, the trash man as an example. Yeah. The trash man comes twice a week. If he doesn't come one time, everybody gets upset. Yeah. Oh, you get yeah. used to it, right? Yeah. You get used to it. Same you'll be all over next door on that one, I promise. That's right. <laughs> same thing with your content. It's the same thing with your content. You know, you gotta keep gotta keep getting out there, especially when you give all the wonderful information you do. I try hard it's all I can tell you but you do you guys support me and that's what allows me to do what I do to give back to society so we're all in this together and we all Absolutely. help one another we I know love, but y'all are just amazing I am hey, well, I'm impressed you. well I appreciate we're, that. we just love what y'all are doing with all the great initiatives I know we talked about the backpack that, that you're doing and you had mentioned there's a couple other other ones that are coming up. Yeah. Well, our, our company, typically every quarter, we do an annual drive of some sort. Um, Last was a blood drive. We did the blood drive. Wow. Mm -hmm. um, it's the uh, back to school backpack drive. And then right after that, we march into the Alzheimer's walk, okay. uh, which is at La Sentara. Thousands of people come out and support that. Mm -hmm. um, we do have that on our Red Lion Realty Facebook page. If you would okay. please donate and support. Right. Um, you know, I don't know if anybody's been touched by Alzheimer's or dementia, but yes. but just about I, I've yet to meet somebody that says no, I, I haven't. So right. 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 And, and do you have a goal or a campaign on your website? Or we do. We it's, do? it's on our Facebook page for Red Line okay. Realty Group. Um, we're trying to raise a thousand dollars. I want to say we're hovering around five hundred, so we're at the halfway point. Awesome. And our our goal is to hit it before we do the walk. That's great. Um, and then uh, in the holidays between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Uh, we do a huge drive for CAPS Animal Shelter okay. and Boys and Girls Orphanage. So we really focus on the pets and, and uh, the orphans from Thanksgiving to Christmas. The boxes were overloaded, overloaded. last year. Oh, wow. Overloaded. Wow. I don't know how many vehicles it took for us to get everything there, but everybody was amazing. Yep. Wow. Well, we're excited to be a part of this. Yes. Oh, yes. Fun, really fun things going on. So, no, we applaud you guys supporting and helping yes, with this. Sure it's, and you're going to keep our brains going and thinking and yeah. and, and, and sharing all this then. good stuff. So <laughs> I know, love it. I think making them interactive, making the, the multiple cameras always spices it up. It's a lot of fun. Really oh, nice. yeah. What? yeah. Well, I got to control it. Change Thanks. equals oh. growth. Yeah. <laughs> you're not, yeah. You're not changing. Yeah. You're not growing. <laughs> right. No, so. Absolutely. Uh, this is my favorite thing to do. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. And Priscilla now I got used three, to not like and now doing I got three videos. cameras on me. Uh, I was yes. like, oh so my you went gosh. from one to three. All yeah. the and you got mics. And see, oh, yeah. the problem is I don't ever go back and look at these. Oh, yeah. They're fun. No. Oh, you yeah. should. No. 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 Never? No. Yeah. Uh, you'll get used to it. Okay. You will. You definitely right. get used to it. I watch right. them every once in a while. Yeah. yeah. I do. Just to critique myself so I can do something better next time. No, no, okay. Yeah, well, I'm very, I'm very similar, but I also don't. I, I've noticed that I don't typically watch my own uh, content uh, when I put stuff out for people. Thank you. Because I've seen it a Thank thousand you. times. Yes. <laughs> I'm okay with video content. It's when you start doing the audio, when you keep repeating the audio, that drives me crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like he's got a real. Oh, he's wait got a, a minute. Okay, real, this is a cut. You know, okay. customer says, "Hey, we love to see some of your work because you know, seeing is believing." Yes. Right? Yeah. Yes. So we show the reel. It's about two or three minutes. I want to peel my eyes because I've heard the song so many times. So, oh, which well, which song like do you play? A professional play it? musician and have to do that well, every night. I, I, you know, that's a good. I point. use a very generic song, uh, but it's fantastic for what it is. But um, it is definitely memorable, and it definitely it's not quite "Let It Go" tier, but it, it's almost. Or, you know, but is it Disney different song? though, no. as as a as a as a musician, when you hear your own music since you made it? Uh, well, it does get monotonous in time okay. too. Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. I, I mean it does. I mean, there's nights that I can be spot on playing the drums, and then there's other nights that I just I have a hard time getting in time because it's become monotonous. I mean, yeah. And the real pros that can go out and do it day in and day out, and oh. you would never know. Yeah, we need to set up a drum system. Uh -huh. And record him doing this. It'd be great. We could do that. Oh. Need to. Do you know wonderful. how many drum sets he has? Oh yeah, 
Six. Six. Wow. She set up two. Joe, you know, Joe's a drummer well, as well. I have yes. three set up at all the times, so you can come over and trust me. You can <laughs> yeah. play. I got three drum sets ready to okay. go. That's so amazing. he has one that you know he puts on his headphones, and his wife doesn't hear. That's uh, the electric kit. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's the mm-hmm. peacemaker. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 I'm familiar. So <laughs> yeah. it's cool. But he, he had a drum set ma- made with the Red Lion Realty. Did you really? I have a Red Lion uh-huh. Realty drum mm-hmm. logo on it, and mm-hmm. then it, I had it custom made by Ludwig. It took me about a year to get the kit. Nice. But it, it's a Texas flag wrap on the drum set. That's awesome. Ooh, that sounds really nice. So it's nice. full blown Texas theme, Red Lion Realty. Oh, that's, that's, yeah, it's cool. That is it's cool. cool. I'll show you. You would some enjoy that. You gotta show I would. Things. We have to enjoy would. that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so now when I go to different concerts, live event, you know, live concerts, she brings me drumsticks. Drumsticks one. Well, now we know what to get him. Drumsticks. Yeah. <laughs> you know to get him. Uh-huh. Well, if you play enough, you always you, you always end up going through all. Hey, of you them. need to make yeah. some yeah. tap drumsticks. That's well, what you need to do. That's not a bad idea. Just yeah. Nice purple, big. No, no, too late. No, nope, it's <laughs> happening now. Nope. <laughs> no, no. You know what? That would like be a great thing. To tips. That's how we yeah. operate. We'll, we'll make <laughs> glow in the dark. We'll make them on shirts. <laughs> yeah, that's no. perfect. Yeah. perfect. Logo, oh, nice big bowl. with sparklers we going out the ends. See, now we're talking. You know, I got to play it's and fun. shoot. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. We do the expo, the pop up stuff. It. When we go to expos and stuff, we do all that stuff. Displays, banners, the whole nine yards. But we'll sit there and we'll start thinking of something. I'm like, hey, Joe, quickly make it on graphics and let's put it on a cup. Or put on a shirt. It's fun. Oh, that we have is a lot wonderful. of fun. I don't want to go home. We have I so much love fun. it. I can't <laughs> wait do. to come we and do. see y'all. We do I just can't that. wait. So, we y'all really are do. located where? Historical portion of Richmond. Okay. Off of uh, 762 and 90. By the exactly where right. that is. Right we had a smart board. We do a lot of teaching. We do a lot of knowledge transfer. That's really what we're here to help with. Is really, you come in, you have yeah. an idea, we'll help you out with it. Oh, I just can't wait. We have a, We have a graphic on our door, and it says, you know, like here is where your ideas find their path. Yeah. Oh, that's you know? cool. Yeah. That's and really cool. Well, that's you know, that's the goal. Yeah. To get people on, you know, they, they they may not even know what they're where they need to go. And we get that a lot actually. We get that a lot. Where it's it, just it sounds like we've only what covered do do? a snippet of what you guys oh, yeah. do. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I mean how I Right. I, I think for the most part, most people think IT can be expensive. We understand yes. that. But at the same time, our goal is to make it cost effective where everybody can have access to it. Just like the internet. Everybody has access to the internet nowadays. Right. You know, no right. Matter. So are all the things listed on your website, all the... For, for the majority, yes. We may, have a, we may yes. have a secret menu or two, if there you is. know what I mean. But it's yes. kind of like yeah. you go to McDonald's <laughs> or whatever. Like Torchies yes. has a secret right. menu. That's right. That's right. Yes. That's right. I didn't know about any of that stuff until a couple months ago. I guess See, I'm now old. <laughs> I didn't, no, I didn't know either. Hero. Jason is, yeah. is really into that stuff. So you can ask Jason, he'll tell you. Okay. Oh, yeah. So well, it's Jason, like the other guy, he's not here. The sauce. Pokemon, yeah. you know, you just, you kind of find it. That's Jason. Oh. Pokemon. It's, very, okay. it's a very yeah. apt description. Yes, yes it, it actually really is. is. Yeah. Really yeah. Is. <laughs> That's cool. It's I love it. Some dynamics, right? I really love is. it. <laughs> so who's your ideal candidate? I know it's broad, yeah. but. I, That's a wonderful question. And I would say because we support all industries, I would say we're looking for people that are coachable, people that want to change, people that are willing to embrace change. I'll use yesterday as an example. We were at a fitness center here in Katy. Okay. A uh, great group of guys were we smoke fitness and uh, they're working with them on social media campaigns. And one of the gentlemen that's a trainer, mm-hmm. he goes, Hey, well, I do marketing too. I do marketing and I do all this stuff. And that's great. Mm-hmm. And we're here to support as long as you're willing to, to hear learn. what we have to say. Right. We're, we're, we're not, we're not the only ones that know how to do this stuff. Right. But we're here to compliment and help you and use this as your extension. Right. So I would say having, Someone that's coachable and willing to listen and willing to grow is what's important for us in sure. a, a client. I find that a lot of times I, I see people, they want to be inspired, uh, but not improve. Right. Because whatever they were doing yesterday, they go get inspired today at the meeting. Right. Mm-hmm. right. But tomorrow they go right back to doing what they were doing right. the day before right. or, or the, you know, two days ago. Yeah. So I hear exactly what you're saying. Absolutely. You know, whenever I worked in enterprise IT, um, you know, I would go in as a consultant. And, you know, you're walking in different cultures. Every organization has a different culture. Yeah, sure. Right? And it's, you know, we're there to help you. We're there to, to help solve whatever challenges you have, but we're here as a team. 
law of the time. For them to achieve their that, goals. That's correct. Not your goals, that's, their goals. That's yeah, correct. But it you, is. You're unfortunately, right. Unfortunately, you have a CISO that, that hires uh, hires the organization to come in and support whatever initiatives you have. And what happens is if some of the people that work there don't want to embrace that because they're worried about losing their job, they're worried about whatever situation they're in, they maybe insecurity, whatever else. But we're here to support. That's right. that's we're, we're, that's all we do. You're just trying to take them to the next level. Yeah, yeah. that's it. It's like steroids. I told I told I told Alan yesterday, hey man, it's like steroids. And he looked at me, he's like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, yeah. He's, a, he's yeah. a big guy, by the way. He's yeah. very yeah. big gentleman. Yeah. yeah. Yep. And so mm -hmm. I want to give a, a big thank you to. Is it TAF or TAF? I it's wanna, TAF. TAF. It's TAF. Yes. For everything that they did today, I applaud uh, their support in our local community and environment. Everything. Um, everything. Thank, thank you, you all much. for all of what you guys are doing. And thank you for making these amazing events. They're amazing. I can't thank wait to see what comes next from y'all. We're excited. Yeah. We really are. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. again, to echo, love the events. I would been to everyone so far, except for the one that the first one I missed. And I was uh -oh. so I angry. I want comments to see out. what they think about the setup. <laughs> it was good. And if we should yes. If you would, this. please drop a comment. Yeah. Hopefully you like the, the way we changed it up yeah. today. Yeah. Um, and if you want to reach out and meet with uh, TAF, what's the best way for them to connect with you, gentlemen? We are TAF.com, yes. or you can just type in TAF Solutions on Google and we'll come up. Okay, yep. T-A-F-F. Just T-A-F. T-A-F. Okay, yes. all right. That's right. All right. We are TAF.com. Right. Mm -hmm. All good. All okay, right. cool. cool. And Richard, how did they get with you? Uh, you can read the lion realty group .com. Um We are all over social media. Just type in Red Lion Realty. Uh, and we'd love to help you if you're thinking about buying or selling, or if you just want real estate advice, pick up the phone, give me a call. I'm, I, I help people all the time. I'm the Realtors Realtor. I get other Realtors and brokers that call me going, hey, I'm experiencing this. Have you ran across this in the past? Yeah. And I share the knowledge with them. I'm, I'm here to help. I got Always. a story about your website. So I was trying to drive out to your location and I didn't have my phone with me. I told Joe, I said, Joe, I got to get a hold of Richard. He's like, well, go to his website. Yeah. Normal websites, you don't get, you don't get the owner. Called your phone number, you answered. Oh, thank you. It's great. great. Mm -hmm. And that's true. And he always picks up his phone. If he doesn't, yep. he calls you back in 10 minutes. Yep, as soon as I get free. Yeah. yeah. So it, it's a blessing. How can they get a hold of you, Priscilla? So, select title, we are here at 23930 West Hummer Parkway, Suite 101, um, right here in Katy. And we're in the same strip center with the Ulala and La Finca. Wonderful um, cupcakes. Yes. <laughs> Just saying. Oh, wow. Um, and so, um, you know, we are always available. My cell number is 832-372-2777. And our website is www.select-title.com. So here to help anytime we can. We appreciate everybody tuning in this week. Okay. If you would, please reach out to the guys at TAF. Um, they're going to see them again soon. Yes, they, they're going to be a part of everything we got coming forward, guys. Yes. Oh, well, that's fantastic. Thank, Thank you so you much for having us. Thank you. Yes. Thanks. It.